Today, we're veering off the conventional path and diving into a whimsically hypothetical world. What if, instead of Eleven and her crew, we had Bob the Builder to take on the terrifying creatures of Stranger Things upside down? Let's figure out how many Bobs it would take to defeat these monsters. Don't forget to let me know in the comments what you'd like to see in our next video. I'd love to bring your creative ideas to life, and as a bonus, I'll give you a shout-out in our upcoming content. Don't miss this exciting opportunity to be recognized in our next video. We're starting small with Dart, the baby Demogorgon. Just a little, slightly dangerous tadpole from the upside down. In this early stage, Dart could be easily outsmarted by one strategically clever Bob the Builder, armed with his trusty tools. Up next, the Demodog. Dart's grown-up form is far more menacing with its monstrous size and hunger for flesh. Defeating a Demodog would be no easy task. It'd require a construction team of 1,000 Bobs wielding their sturdy tools to trap and outwit the creature. Let's fly higher to the Demobat, a flying terror from the upside down. Considering the challenge of aerial combat, a squadron of 1,500 bobs, equipped with DIY flying machines, should be enough to clip this creature's wings. Now we face the Demogorgon, a formidable foe indeed. With its sheer size, strength, and speed, a full demolition crew of 320,000 bobs would be required to level the playing field and take it down. The hospital monster, a grotesque amalgamation of the flayed, is not a sight for the faint-hearted. Its ability to absorb hits would need a robust crew of 750,000 bobs, each using heavy machinery to grind it down. Next, the towering spider monster. With its menacing size and multiple appendages, it would take a staggering 3 million bobs. Picture this bobs with cranes and wrecking balls, aiming to dismantle this horror piece by piece. The ultimate Stranger Things villain and mastermind of the Upside Down is a formidable monster. To combat such power, you'd need the strength of 4 million bobs, all armed with anti-magic tech and construction might, to challenge Vecna. Lastly, we have the Mind Flayer, the orchestrator of chaos in the Upside Down. This entity's power to control and manipulate makes it a formidable adversary. It would take an incredible battalion of 200 million bobs, perfectly coordinated, to outsmart and defeat this monstrous overlord. And there we have it! That's our fun take on how many Bob the Builders would be required to defeat the beasts of Stranger Things upside down. This was a quirky fusion of two different worlds for your entertainment. But remember, we always love to hear from you. Drop your creative video ideas in the comments, and you might get a shout out in our next video. Don't miss your chance to feature in our upcoming content. Thanks for joining us here at Hollywood Corner and keep those imaginations running wild.